How's it going everyone? Welcome back to The Grind. Now, in the last episode we actually had some good games. We got the engine. Good stuff. Uh, we're just going to be continuing. Uh, free games to see how we can, how much XP we can get. Uh, we do have some boosters on because I was just finishing off Team Clash and that's now completed. Uh, we've got to level 10 for that. So I'll be getting Daki as a commander, which is all good. Um, and yeah, let's just get straight into some games, shall we? Okay, so we're on Tundra. Hmm, not the best map, not the worst map, so we'll see how it goes. Um, yep, sound is all good. Nice. And we're going to go to the hill, and we're just going to see what we can do. There's two RT, which isn't really so great, but oh well. You know what? Playing the Leo in Team Clash and then playing this just makes you realise just how bad the gun dispersion on this tank actually is. Uh, especially while moving. Uh, I don't want to go all the way up. And I know I can get hit from RT over here. Usually there's some players that will go up, but I guess not today. Artie's trying to hit me. You know what? Yeah, we'll actually push. Now we can push up. Because it's relatively safe. And we can go and see who we can shoot over here. It's going to be nice. Shoot him. He didn't really aim that shot, so... Understandable that that missed. I didn't actually think that would hit, but okay, sure. Easy shot on the E3, hopefully. Mm, no, we don't. Okay. Cool. I thought I didn't see um, that much damage, but then I remembered that I have it off uh, for when a tank's dead. So, okay. We get a nice ammo rack. The gods have smiled upon me today. Uh, we should be able to get a shot on this E3, maybe? Maybe not, though. If this I-7 goes back, we can have a shot. But... Not the best of uh, opportunities. Okay, I need to be careful about peeking this because of the Yagpanzi 100. So it's actually probably better if I just be patient and just shoot over this side. Even though there's nothing to shoot at the moment, um, it's better to do that rather than trying to force uh, damage. Because if I try and force damage from the other side, it's not really going to work. Hey, right, there we go. We're not going to get spotted by him because uh, he's outside the thing. <laughs> that was very close, though. One into him, and we'll fall back again because the I-7 is probably going to peek me to try and get shot off as revenge. Uh, Skoda can't actually make it up there, so that's all okay. Uh, you know what? It's stupid if I go and peek that again. We're going to peek over this side and see if we can get some shots on other people. Like the Yagpanzi 100 and the others. We might even be able to get a nice shot on the 1390 in a second. I don't care about the I-7. Run. You're not even going to run. Okay. i got to be careful about Yapanzi 100. Come on, Soaprox. Stop. Thank you. I hate the Soaprox in this game, where they just make you fall down hills for no reason. Okay. We're down. This is good. Um, this game still has potential to be 4K, even 5K, if we get lucky, but... 
I don't know. Hopefully 4K. Then that will really help our um, DPG out. Especially if we've had some really bad games recently. Tell you what though, the engine's really helping us out quite a bit. Um, I want to go this way. Uh, because then I can actually uh, use this terrain as cover. T95 is there, but I can't really do much against him. Oh yeah, ni nice critical hit. 705A, I want to bait a shot from him. I mean, I wanted to bait a shot to just try and... I don't think Artie can hit me. Not if he's there. If he's in the corner, then he can, but... That's unlucky. That's actually stupidly unlucky. That was pretty well aimed. I can't really shoot him now either. And we're starting to cap. Now, you know what? I'm just going to take a hit. I'm going to take a hit and go behind this T95. Okay. Oh. Well, it doesn't matter. I didn't think that the Conway would shoot me, and we're capping, so I had to. I got forced to go and do damage. We didn't really need to cap, honestly. Capping's the only thing that stopped us from doing extra damage. Okay, apply that. Get some nice amount of credits and XP. Decent amount of damage. Like, why did this guy cap? He's done 1.5k. There's just no point. Ah, oh, it's so frustrating when people cap in this game. Like, it's an easy win from there. We had them just surrounded. We didn't need to cap. But there you go. Anyway, let's continue. Okay. Like, do you know what? The one thing that I've really noticed with this tank is you need a lot of patience with it. If you don't have patience, this tank just isn't going to work. So, in that case, we're going to build our little Unicum nest, and we're going to stay there until such time as we can actually do something. It is a tier 8 game, though, so... i tell you what, with the engine, this does actually feel a lot better. Um, but it's still... That's not really the way that I wanted to... Right, for God's sake. That's not even me getting spotted. Now I am. Oh. Goodness sake. Your team are worse than the enemies. We didn't even get spotted by that EBR. Man, I'm not spotted. This guy is. Goodness sake. Oh. So frustrating. All we have to do is just sit here and just take shots as and when we can. And just pray that no one shoots us back or blind fires us like they have done for all of this amount of damage that we've taken. <sighs> Definitely getting away from this guy. Okay, now I'm falling back even further because he's just knocked down another tree. And doesn't take any damage for it. Okay, cool. Gun's behaving today, which is nice. Steps definitely isn't one of my favourite maps. It used to be really nice and fun, but I don't know. It's just become a very, very campy map now.
That's not going to pen. I already knew that wasn't going to pen even before I shot. Not unless he turns his turret. I can't pen in frontally because I don't. I mean, I can. I could just fire this at him, but I don't really want to. It's still like a 50 50 if I pen him, even with APCR. Bad shot. Fortunately, this is all that we can do at the moment. Oh, he's turned. Missed, but oh well. Uh, we're going to turn the tank this way, because that way we can actually get more gun depression. Without keep going up towards the Progetto that we know is like just continuously spotted. For whatever reason. This guy peeking again. Very nice. I mean, this game's already over. Like, I don't know what the enemy team are doing at this point. Like, I, I really don't understand the trend of everyone just going and sitting at the back here. I see it a lot on this map. Like the, the first thing that the enemy team will do, or the team that spawns this side, is just go and sit there, doing nothing. I just... You don't gain anything out of it. You just lose. The only time that that works is if, if the whole enemy team pushes this and none of them get spotted and they just kill them all. Just like one in a million. I'll tell you what I am going to do actually. We're actually going to go into here and we might be able to get some really nice damage done. From over here. As long as I don't get spotted doing this. Oh, I didn't mean to knock that over. That's really bad actually. Put one into his lower plate. We shouldn't get spotted from here. I'm going to fall back. As long as there's trees, you should be fine in this position. It's 50-50. We roll for 5-10? Okay. 5-25 is the max roll on this tank. SU-101 is the only thing that I can hear at the moment. Nice. A low roll, but expected. Like, we did just roll for 510, so... And now we can just go and clean up, if we can. And get a little bit more, hopefully, maybe. Who knows? Uh, 2.8 isn't bad. I'm happy with that. It's not quite 3k, but... Mm. Oh well. For a turbo game, that's pretty okay. Oh, and of course I bounce. Uh, I just don't understand why people go into that corner. It just doesn't make sense. To be honest, I think I should have gone down here a lot earlier. Okay, well, we did actually hit some blind shots, which is nice. We can apply that. Uh, so 3.2, which is good. Uh, yep, yep. Uh, okay, let's just continue going. Right, proc. Um... Yeah, we just go and hide, I guess. I'm going to load HE. We can knock down a tree that's over here. Um, and then we get some more camo. I don't know where the even 90 is going to go. Uh, do they have a, like a EBR? Can't see. T49, even 90 and LT432. No, they don't. Do we have an EBR? No. Okay, well. It's a nice EBR-less game. So it means that we're not going to get YOLO spotted. Well, at least not right away. Okay, this is the tree that I'm on about. 
you go and hit it right here. It knocks itself forwards. Voila, you get some extra bush. Um, just go all the way up, and you can sit here. And you can just chill. You can actually go into the bush more as well, and then that way you don't get spotted from the middle. Well, it's, it's less likely. And now we wait for about... Well, there's 13 minutes left, so... Uh, cheers. I just love Prokhorovka. Like, it's a really, really good map. Let our light tanks and bat chat do their thing. We'll just chill. Ba, 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 ba. At least it's not a turbo game. Uh, like that, that's the thing that you've got to take into consideration here. You're not getting a turbo game. You are getting a very boring game. But, I mean... At least it's not a turbo game. You know what? I like blind shooting. So, we are going to go and blind shot. Did we get spotted? Nope, okay. We can shoot from here. Which means that there's no one in, like, directly, like, here or something. We have loads of shells, so I'm just going to blind shoot some. We hit, we hit. If we don't, we don't. Ooh. I think he's like there. Yep. And it's important that we actually do kill this guy. Then we back off. We didn't even get spotted for that. And now we can push back up again. So we traded one for one, which is fine. It's nice. I'm just going to pull back again and uh, continue blind shooting. Who knows, maybe we might hit someone. You never know. I'm going to aim like over there as well. Maybe we can hit like Arty or something. Uh, we'll also aim... Over that way, because Artie likes to camp over that way. Also there. Right, it's there. Yeah. Artie might be somewhere there. I don't know. We have loads of shells, so... And that one actually hit the ground. We might be able to see it hit the ground, actually. Yeah, that one hit the ground. Usually people will sit there, and they'll just sit there forever. Ooh, Mr. T-54. Uh, okay. You know what? That's very annoying. Why is he not spotted? Like, right, hello? Literally just a Pajetto sitting there in the open. Uh, don't you just love Prokhorovka? It's so much fun. I'm going to knock this one down. I'll go behind it and then it goes forwards. Gives us some more cover. Bush Master. I mean, you can even knock this one over. Like, you can create a pretty nice area where you can just sit. It's 
so. Yeah. Create our, uh, our nest. And then you just sit in the nest and you chill. You don't leave the nest. You never leave the nest. The nest is love. The nest is life. Anyway, more coffee. Mm. Oh! That I can't really shoot at the moment. Um, that's an issue. Oh, that's actually a little bit more than just an issue. Is he just going to continue going? Because if he continues going, then I can shoot him. And I shouldn't get spotted. But through this, I should not get spotted. Uh oh. I can just keep him. Go forwards. Go back. Continue tracking him. Back. Uh oh, go forwards. Oh, come on. No. Oh, for goodness sake, he missed. I need to keep going forwards. And we bounce. Sick. Right. Yes, I love life. Um, don't take another hit. Oh, for goodness sake. Try and get into this bush. Maybe. Let me just chill here. I mean, we do have a light tank, and I don't know what he's doing. He has moved, I think. I have no idea. More coffee. I needed that 60 TP to stay spotted. Uh, if only we had this guy who was actually playing. Is he AFK or something? Like, I swear I saw him moving around earlier. None of the tanks are really um, hard to pen. Or at least it won't make any difference if I fire APCR premium or not. Because I'm going to bounce off the, off the STRV no matter what. Like crazy French man. Oh, this is awkward. I mean, there's nothing that I can do at the moment. I have to just sit here. I don't have the health to go and like go back into that spot there and spot stuff. <sighs> so frustrating.
This could all be avoided if only there was a light tank that was actually playing the game. Is he actually AFK? I can't spot him. Like, I can't see him. If I go forwards now to try and spot this, as you can see, I can't see over the ridge line. But if I go forwards, I get spotted and die. I have to just pray that they're going along this little bit ridge bit here, and then I can spot them and fall back. But if they spot me, then I'm probably going to die to artillery anyway. So, so, so frustrating playing this game. I mean, it's lost, so there's not really anything I can do. I'm a one-shot to everyone. Yeah, I'm a one-shot to everyone. Even a T-49, no matter what gun he's using, can potentially one-shot me. Oh, we get an extra shot in. There you go. <sighs> Not a lot you can do. Yeah, I, I really don't understand this guy. He just didn't play the game. I mean, fine, he's he's new, but like that doesn't excuse you for not playing the game. Yeah, this was just an awful game. Like, their team done something and our team did nothing. But there you go. You can't do anything. Like that's just Prokhorovka. You need a, you need light tanks on Prokhorovka. Otherwise, it's game over. And there, there you go. That was the grind for today. Two point nine k, average damage. Obviously, it would have been like 3.2 or something like that if we'd actually been able to play the last game. But we can't because, yes, very good. Uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you uh, enjoyed. If you did, then make sure you leave a like and subscribe. It helps me out greatly. And uh, comment of the day is going to be the number one. Simply put the number one in a comment and I will leave you a little smiley face and give you a little love heart on your comment. So, uh, yeah, you comment that. I'll, uh, I'll do that. And yeah, thank you very much for watching and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.